Well, hello, people, and welcome back to another episode of Space Astronomy 2 with me, your favorite monk is Mashkeeds. Welcome back. What have we, oh, my hat's falling down. Oh, my, my green helmet is falling off. Beautiful. So welcome back. What have we been doing? Well, thinking about space. Let me adjust my, my speaking mouth. There we go. There, beautiful. Be get out my, my earphones. Thank you. So what have we been doing? We've kind of been messing around, and I think we need to start working on rocket fuel right fuel so there's rocket fuel from ender io which is like hooch and stuff right but then there's also fluid column but then there's fuel from galactic craft core where was that didn't we have an achievement book hold on hold your butt where's our achievement book there it is it might tell us. Somebody commented a long, long time ago, and I immediately forgot. They were like, hey, you should do it my way. I've, I'll show you. And then I immediately forgot. See, design and build a base on each planet. Design and build a place, build a space station on at least two planets. Design and build a space station with a height, with a Y height of 60. So, I don't know. Uh, collect oil and create rocket fuel. Okay. So what kind of oil do we have? Well, we have canola oil, and we have oil from actually additions. Can we do anything with you? Not really, hey? Huh? Creosote oil, crystallized oil, plant oil, canola oil, empowered oil, oil bucket. So let's... First of all, let's see if the fuel loader actually takes. So fuel... Let's, let's make a fuel loader. Perfect. Get some of this stuff out of my inventory. Jeez, Louise. Ooh, uh, drum. I think we... So we have crystallized oil. We have empowered oil. And we have oil. We don't... And do we have seed oil kicking around? Seed oil? No? Seed oil? No. No seed oil. And we want a bucket, probably. Hey? So let's see... What is this? Void bucket. Who's telling all this stuff to craft all this business? So we want to see... Hold on. If the fuel loader will take buckets of anything that's not oil. So it doesn't seem to take, it doesn't want to take crystallized oil. That's fine. We assumed as much. How about empowered oil? Nope. Don't want to take that. How about oil? Nope. Can't take that. So it can't take any of that stuff. Is there a refinery? Refinery. There is um, refinery, refinery. So there is a refinery. Okay, can we have a flux plug, please? Flux? Nope. Man, I'm having a hard time spelling. I'm also super jittery. I drank a lot of coffee, so I'm just, just like my my little monkey heart, to j just a going, you know, just a going. Ah, uh, so what if we put you here? Give you some power. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then bucket of oil. No. You don't seem to care about this either. Oh! Not enough power. How do you not have power? Is it because it's on the wrong side? Probably on the wrong side, hey? I hate this. So what we could do... How you doing? You getting power now? We're fine. You're still not getting enough power, hey? How are you not getting power? Are we out of power? <gasps> We're not. So you just don't like my power, huh? You just don't think my power is good enough for you? Hmm? Why Why you don't think my power is good enough for you, buddy? Buddy old pal? What if we just like slap you here? Will you accept? Nope. We're fine. Not enough power still. Hold on. Hold your butt. Just a little test. A little testy poo. Oh, wait. Maybe it gets power from the top. It can get power from the top, too. Okay, so it's fuel in. It's fuel in, power in, fuel out. So if we give it power, are you going to make... Um, It seems to be working. Perfect. Let's actually give it a little bit more just to see. We're not sure what it's going to get, but it very obviously is giving, getting us oil. That's kind of strange that a mod would do that, hey? So let's give it a little while. It might be an oil bucket. Okay. So 
What's the plan then? We need to automatically make canola seeds. And then we have to press it and we have to do all sorts of stuff. So it looks like we need a fuel room. We already had this done, but we need to do it again because we moved, right? How are you doing? You going faster? Okay. So what do we need? We need... Okay, so we need a fuel room. And we need a greenery room. And they probably need to be close to each other. Why is there garbage? Oh, gross. There's like stuff on my mouse. Okay, get out of here. Get stupid mouse. There we go. So we need a fuel room. And... A fluid room. So maybe we just put them right here and here. Okay? Fluid. Greenery. Right? I think that's a good idea. Well, actually, no. Let's make the fluid room here so we it's closer to us. Uh, we'll make them right across from each other. Here and here. Perfect. So we need a greenery room to automatically make greenery stuff. I think that's a good idea. How are you doing? <gasps> oh, it is working. It's really slow, but it's working. Is there any other refineries? No, there's not. There's just this one. So what about, ooh, palladium. Where do we get palladium from? Jupiter. We got to go to Jupiter to get more stupider, you guys. Oh, man. So what do we do with you? Nothing really, but it looks beautiful. Okay. So how do... First off, we want to have a bunch of redstone conduits. Or do we? Hold on. Let me see here. So we can make it, no, we don't need, we don't, we don't need to do, we can make it powerless. That's the thing. Every time I think about it, I'm like, well, if we do it refined, if we do it refined storage, we can make it completely automated and we can control it a little bit better. But if we do it with drawers, then it doesn't really matter. Like we're fine. So let's make some drawers. Um, let's make a lot of drawers. Okay, what else do we need? Downgrade? No, we don't need downgrade. Uh, we do need a void upgrade. We do need void upgrades, I think. Sure. Maybe some storage upgrades? I think I'm okay with this. And then a the controller, okay? So we want... How do we want this to... Oh, if we put it close enough. Hold on, hold on. We actually might be pretty smart here. Hold on, hold your butt, hold your butt. If we, why do we have an extra key in there? So we want, which one was it? Emit signal for most full slot. Emit signal for total storage. That's okay. But we'd prefer it to have emit signal for most full. I mean, or just emit signal in general, right? Okay, so what do we want? We want, oh, we want bone meal. We want bone. We want, how do we, what's the best way to get bone meal? Um, the electric crusher. So the crusher does six. The sag mill is a little bit better and we don't really have to do flint. And the sag mill is faster. So let's get a sag mill. Perfect. Uh, capacitor, just in case it doesn't have one, which it should. Okay. Beam, 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 beam. Exporter. Uh, ooh, stack, maybe? Sure, sure, sure. Well, we don't need it to go very fast. In fact, we don't need it to go fast at all. Uh, flux plug. This is kind of for automation, not particularly in fact we could have just left it like that and then an ender chest so we want an ender chest so we can transfer around what do we need we probably need bone meal my inventory is getting pretty full pretty quick let's let's deal with this first real quick what did we want to do why is there stuff in my inventory we were trying to last episode because we've enchanted a lot of our tools with repairing we want to see if we can go like this conduit so we want to pull out on this one this so that'll make it full all oh, beautiful then we just want to do this huh mending mending is mending not working oh it did oh beautiful then we am ending oh yeah and then get it out of my inventory okay so it has to be in our hand 
And it's not super good. Well, still though, it's repairing it. Okay, so we'll be back to this. So we figured out how to repair our stuff. Easy if we slap mending on it. That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay. So what were we, what were we, what were we doing? We want to export. What else do we need? Oh, we need bone meal and green and a sign. Bone meal. So we're not making bone meal from anywhere, right? We're not making bone meal from anywhere. Green. And that should be fine. Oh, and a sign, a sign. Okay. So we need, because if we're going to make a bunch of oil, we need a bunch of greenery. If we need a bunch of greenery, so uh, green. Yes, we'll do it like this. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Break these bad boys. Anytime. Beautiful. Beautiful. Slap a sign on this. Bone meal. So anytime we need bone meal for any thing, which is really only one thing, we can use it. In fact, we could probably, we can ender chest bone meal to our space base if we want, right? That's a good idea. Okay. Uh, where do we want this to keep going? To here at least, right? So we want the sag mill here. So we want the ender chest there. Sag mill here. We want to say, hey, auto export push down. Sure, 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 sure. Flap the capacitor in there. We want to export full bones, obviously stacks at a time if you wouldn't mind. Perfect, beautiful, you big, beautiful baby. Uh, we want some conduits. We still need to get our like base wireless, you know? Man, this mouse is gonna friggin', it's gonna make me crazy. You know when it's too close? Like, you know when the cord is too close and it just drives you nuts and you just wanna flip right out? Yeah, that, that's me, all the time. So we want a conduit, so we want some power going to it. And then that should be it for the bone meal. So now we're gonna have a bunch of bone meal. In fact, Yeah, no, I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this state of events, okay? So now we have bone meal. So now we need... What do we need? We need... A mechanical user, fertilized soil, all sorts of stuff. So we want some speed. We got some... Uh, no, we can use these ones. Honestly, this will be plenty fast. Might as well do this one for apples. Might as well do this one for seeds. Perfect. And then, mechanical user. B-E-A-U-tiful. Easy peasy. Um, so here's our wiring system. E, mm, yes, let's put it here. In fact, how far is this? 1, 2, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 14, 15. Oh, yeah. So if we put... The drawer controller over here, ish, doesn't have to be right right here. Oh my, it could be. If we put the drawer controller right here, and put it right here, put it right here. That's a good place for it. If we put it right here, then the scanner, yes, that means the scanner will be able to see. Can we scan again? Oof, scan. <sighs> No, it's still got all these drawers. That's fine. What about this one? There's nothing in you, right? Ah, oh, yes. Yes. Okay. So basically, we just need to undo all of these. They're not routable, so it's not a big deal. So maybe I'll come back and unroute all this stuff later. But currently, it can access all those drawers. So maybe... It's kind of stupid to add another drawer tower. Another drawer cluster on the whole thing. But, like so for instance, seed. So there's no seeds. Well, there is. Okay, so there is kind of some seeds. Uh, what about wheat? No. Potato. So there is potatoes. So the idea would be to pull the potatoes off this drawer controller and put them on this drawer controller. Right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. 
Perfect. I'm happy with this situation. So how are we going to do this now? We want to put some drawers down. We want to go, ooh, but the problem is we want to be able to wire them up nicely. Can we pull? Yeah, we can pull it from the back and the side, right? So we'll go, we'll go like this. So we want, of course, we didn't bring the stuff we actually needed. Sheesh Louise. Okay. So let's just put some stuff. So that'll be apples, apples and whatever. Seeds, 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 uh, seeds. We don't have to make it this big. Here's the thing. It, it'll one part, it'll one part be for storage of like everything. Like all the, the saplings and stuff, or all the bushes and stuff. But otherwise, we're good. We're good to go. So let's get a drawer key. Lock it. Lock it down. Perfect. Now, I'll be right back after we get some seeds, fertilized soil, and all that whole shebang. You know? BRB. Oh, okay. So the canola is getting routed to here. So I slapped a storage... Bob on here, right? The external storage thing. So anytime canola enters the system, it'll try to go to this drawer tower, I guess. Fallen down tower. Okay. So what we want to do... Technically, we could do it like this. Okay. Do we have any conduits? Why do we not have conduits? <sighs> okay. So here's where it's going to start getting messy, where I'm going to have to mess around with it a little bit. I might do that next. Well, no, we can do it now. But here's the thing. When when you mess around with it, uh, we need a bunch of redstone. I think I think that should be good. The idea is we're going to want to have a filter as well. Dang it. Actually, two filters, because we have a canola press. No, we don't. So canola... Perfect. Filter. We can just use the boring ones because we just want one filter each. Okay. Perfect. So two filters. Uh, the canola press. Canola. Canola. So I think we just need one canola press for oil. And then we need drums. Um, Reinforced drums are probably plenty. Is this fine? This is fine. So here's what we want. We want, we don't need a filter because we're dumb. Yep, yep, super dumb, that's fine. So we want fertilized dirt. Do we have a hoe? Oh, we have the all-in-one tool. I'm starting to like it for like, just when I'm not doing anything. Like if you don't, if you're not doing specific tasks, the all-in-one tool is awesome. I mean, technically you could probably do all my stuff if I wanted it to. So we want, Bone meal, uh, upper left slot only, and we can fill this in. We don't really care, I guess. So we'll just we'll leave it. We'll leave it upper left slot only. Right click, uh, place block. Sure, 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 sure. But we want it redstone signal, okay? And here's why redstone signal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because here we want to slap some stuff on this. We want to say, hey. So how how many canola seeds do these have? Four and four. Are you giving off any redstone signal at the moment? Yes. Okay. So what if we knock you down to like three? No. Okay. Beautiful. So then if you're over three, redstone signal. Under three. You're still getting a redstone signal, hey? Under one. Okay. So, well, okay. Redstone signal. Perfect. We're fine with this. So that means the system is going to always try to keep itself stocked at over just over a stack, right? That's exactly what we want. So we want them both on white, white, white. On white, white. Because, and then because we, we can come through here. Watch this. Check this bad boy out. Bam, bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Bam, bam. Uh, yeah, I don't care about you. So we want to slap you there. White. Uh, redstone off. Yes, redstone off. Perfect. Right? 
Yeah, 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 we're happy with this. And then we want some item conduits. I mean, technically we could put him here too. This is fine. So we want to insert on white. Perfect. Then our ender chest, right here, extract on white. All time, always active. Perfect. So now here's what's going to happen. I guess we didn't need the filters. This is fine. So if we ever get... So we're out of canola seeds. Ah, uh, no, this doesn't work. We want it the other way. Dang it. Because technically now... We want it to run. So can we invert this? Probably not, huh? Maybe it's the other way. Let, let, let's go grab the other one. I'm sure, I'm sure one of them works. Worst case is we can invert it, right? Worst case. So at drawer, if we do redstone min upgrade, let's grab a redstone torch just in case. Troc, torch. Perfect. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Okay. So we want to pull this out and pull this out and it shouldn't be getting any redstone signal. Use item on block. Beautiful. That's exactly what we want. Lovely. Okay. Now we want min upgrade. No, we definitely want to re swap this around. Okay. Because the idea is that if if this one's low, if this one's out, and we we want to keep them both stocked up, right? So if canola's out, it still isn't turning on. That's no good. That's no bueno. So what we want to do is we want to invert this. Like so for now. We're going to have to mess around a little bit. Do we have a wrench? Wrench. Beautiful. Bam. White, strong signal, perfect. Bam. This we can disconnect because we don't care about. This, white, strong, white signal, perfect. So we want it the other way. We want it redstone on, okay? Because Y is now, oh no, see this, so they're both still getting it. The only way I could think of it doing it, oh, I guess this isn't so bad. If we're going to invert it anyway. This might be more wiring than we want, though. Yeah, this is more wiring than we want. We're just going to have to do it Ender I.O. We can do, well. Because the idea is whenever we're low on canola, it turns on. And whenever we're low on seeds, it turns on. That's what I'd like. But this wiring is not going to work. So we either go refine storage and say emit, you know, emit if, yeah, the redstone signal is probably the easiest. We're going to definitely do the redstone. That's fine. The, the refined storage. So now this is all getting placed. Now we need a vacuum hopper to suck up this canola and press it, right? So maybe I'll swap this out to refined storage. Maybe we'll do that, right? Is it emitter? No, it's a detector. Perfect. So we'll be right back. Okay, well, you're going to... Okay, hold on, hold on. What? Meg, that's off. Perfect. There we go. That's what we want. And then just pull out. No? Hello? All time. That should be fine, right? How you doing? Probably need a speed upgrade, hey? Mm. Okay, perfect. So now, easy peasy, all that bone meal we're getting. So we're getting a bunch of bones. We're getting a bunch of bone meal. Uh, let me just pop down here. So now we have a detector that says, hey, if we have less than a thousand canola, emit a redstone signal. If we have less than a thousand canola, emit a redstone signal. 
and then we have the mechanical user only on when redstone okay so that means when we get a, when we get a bunch of canola it's going to shut down when we get or no sorry when we get a bunch of canola but we still have low canola seeds it's going to still run that's what we need because we need canola seeds for other stuff we need canola for other stuff so we i mean it should even out when it comes down to it probably will even out but we just want it like this okay so we probably want void upgrades on here too hey just in case like so if the drawers are ever full we want okay we want i'm trying to think here we want the canola to fill up the drawer to about this level but we want to have enough room up to this level so if we say get canola seeds from the quarries and stuff well they have somewhere to go and then once we get over a certain level void it and then once we get below a certain level turn it on you know so it'll keep us stocked at a certain level this is nice i'm okay with this we are getting a lot of canola hey okay so here now the next thing we want to and this doesn't have to be like this extract on orange we're gonna mess around with this later so now it's extracting on orange mm. i wonder what the canola press looks like okay so we want a canola press here and this is the one we want to have a filter on right because we only want canola in here we want to filter on orange so now canola is going to go in here Oh, it does need power. I thought as much. We have a flux plug. We do have a flux plug. Perfect. So, flux plug. Perfect. Mash keys. And then we'll have, slowly, a whole bunch of canola oil. Right? Beautiful. So then once this drum is full, then it'll stop working and the canola will get full. That means this canola will get full. That means it'll stop requesting canola. That means the seeds will eventually get full. What do we do with seeds? So technically, we don't have to void them out, hey? Huh? No, what is this? Right here, seeds. You. So we technically don't have to void them out because we do need seeds for the crystallized canola and we do need seeds for empowered canola. But then at the end of the day, if the drawer is full, turn it into biomash, right? Okay, this works. This is working. Happy, happy time. Also, while we're here, because we always need a stock of apples. Hold on. So we want an emitter. Do we have our met matter? Matter? What's the matter? What's the matter with you? No, that one's full. I don't know what it has in it. Matter. Perfect. This one's good to go. So we need to move this apple. Beautiful. I love that it works like that. Um, can't believe we, she we can shear. Lovely. Why did we get two? Okay, well, whatever. Perfect. So same thing. Oh, we want an emitter too, hey? So let's get rid of some canola. We don't need this much canola in our pockets. Uh, detector. Perfect. Start, start. Give it to me, baby. Beautiful. So similar setup, we want to be able to turn our apples into, and th this one doesn't have to be nothing, right? We can do it like that. But it also means we need a leaf block here, but then also maybe a log there as well. I mean, it doesn't look great, but it's better than nothing. Okay, so we want to insert on white. So you're going to start getting bone meal beautiful we're gonna make you go fast you're going fast and then we want to use the matter transporter put it there perfect so similar situation we want to say oh see look so we have plenty of canola so it shut down on the canola but we're still low on seeds so it's going to keep running those but then the seeds aren't going anywhere so once this is done it's only going to care about canola right beautiful so we want to put, what do we want to put? We want to put uh, like this, like this, like this even. Did we take that emitter? Where'd it go? It's my pockets. Perfect. So we want an emitter and we want to say, hey, 
Less than 1,024 apples give off the redstone signal. Man, we have a lot of apples. Jeez Louise. Okay. But with our wrench, we can disable it. We don't even have to turn it on white, white, white. See? Perfect. Beautiful. So that's going to work. Work on signal. So whenever we get low on apples, it's going to make us apples. Uh, but we also probably want to put our apples in here then. Okay. Perfect. So let's go see how many apples we have. We probably have a whole bajillion bajillion of apples. Can we get... I feel like I'm getting sick. I've been moving around far too fast. Ah, uh, vacuum filter. Ah, uh, we could have used that filter. Yeah, I'm happy with this. Okay. So, apple. So, we have 274 apples. Why no signal? Okay. Regardless, let's get these apples. So why no on, hey? Hold on, hold your button. When below the amount, that's what we did wrong. Redstone on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's why. Use item on block. Beautiful. Now, we have apples. All time. Uh, they are getting stuck, though. So that's... We need a different vacuum hopper. But that's okay. Uh, yeah, you can't... You definitely can't pick those up, hey? Hmm. Oh, is canola that full? Jeez Louise, okay. Let's slap some on you. And then let's slap you, void. So if we ever get way too much canola, we'll still be okay. And then apples, same kind of situation. I'm sure we're not going to need that much. Come on, apples. Can't do your thing. Do your thing, apples. Come on. But still. I mean, we just need to change the vacuum hopper on this. That's fine. That's fine. So now we have, we're automatically producing canola oil. Should we get more presses? Probably not. I think we're okay with this, right? Oh, so it has to be around 16. So we'll always have about 16 stacks of canola-ish, right? Whenever we get less than 16 stacks, beautiful. More 16 stacks, we're happy. I like that. I'm happy with this. Happy with this turn of events. Perfect. So now we just need to keep, we need to change this vacuum hop route and then we're good to go. Beautiful. All right. So uh, that's probably going to be it. So next episode, we're going to mess around with, what else should we do? We can still add, uh, it's not going to be pretty yet. We're making it functional. And then during downtime, I'll make it look pretty. But I functionally, it'll stay the exact same, right? This is just so more, more so we can see it and understand it and then once we kind of have all the wiring down and we're happy and we can expand then we'll then we'll mess around and make it look pretty all right perfect but thank you for watching tune in tomorrow with more space astronomy with me your favorite monkey's mash keys and you have a nice day